So after that misfortune, after that misfortune, we are currently en route to the cabin. So like I was saying, after that misfortunate um, glass break right then, it's really just unlucky. All right, all right, here we go. It's what we call a nice little oak tree. See that right there? Then if you see this magnolia tree right there, y'all are good. All this crap right here, weeds. A lot of these weeds. These things can grow up to 35 feet tall and about three inches in weight. Um, and if you look to your left, you will see a forgotten base. So now that we are at the forgotten base, forgotten base of the home, the old mule got us here perfectly fine. Basically, what happened here was a group of guys got together. Basically, thought it was a good idea for one weekend just to basically come out here and just break stuff. So then you see here where the where some of the men that previously worked here tried to chop down a tree, and when it first came up, it was just sitting straight up. Then eventually, a couple storms came by and knocked it all down. So then after you get off of this trail right here, you're gonna keep going all the way back down here. We can go, we see if we can beat this monster. Hold on. There she blows. Shoot. Dude, it ain't gonna, hold on, let me go check the tires real quick. Good right there. All right, and back on the tour guy after we done got all through that crap. And we're back out here again. Oh, geez, we gotta hold on. Hold on tight, guys. We're going next to our big old hole. Look at that hole. Thousands of alligators have been digging that thing for years. They come up through the, the tunnel of death. Look, this is where Michael Myers was born. And if you come up through here, then you see this vine right here, all right? So basically, once you get up here, you are perfect. Like, see that tree right behind y'all right there? That tree's been dead for three years now. All right, man, we, all right, we're gonna get out of here. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. My bad, man. You good. And as you approach this cabin, you'll see a stream coming all across here. Oh, jeez. And you'll see, look at, look right here. Oh, jeez, Louise. Hold on, let's reverse this baby real quick. And then you'll see as, oh, oh, oh. My bad, hold on. Hold on, I get us out here. And as we come out of these woods after a long day out here, you will come to conclude that we are all out here for a reason. And once you actually get the hang of it, you're, you'll do perfectly fine out here, man. You gotta go slow on these roads because these people really don't like it, you know what I'm trying to say? And as we come across these tree limbs, be on the lookout for Bigfoot, you see him? Yeah, you can't stand for it because he doesn't exist. Coming up onto the grass now, where thousands and thousands of animals live. They're just tiny, you cannot see them, okay? And here we go, and we're off again. And you know, honestly, just once you get the hang of it, it's really not that big of a deal. Oh crap, hold on. I've got to put the park. Come on. And as you look out here, you really then start to get the hang of it then. You really just got to get down low with it. You know what I'm trying to say? All right, now we're going to go see the ghost now. <laughs> On the side of the road, you idiot. Sometimes if you keep doing that, you'll forget where the stuff is. Hold on. Tour, parking tour, hold on. You got to be really silent when you're hunting for these fires. You gotta wait on the flash your little lights. Come on out wherever you are. We got one right here. We can get him. Come on. There we go. We got him. Come on. Come on. Oh, we don't flew away really high. Alright, so the flyer the fireflies weren't that big of a success. They obviously don't like us here at Weird Animal Safari Hari. And hold on, we gotta come over this big old hump right here. Look, we're gonna let it carry you. All right, so like we said, once we get out here, 
we can actually go see some of the livestock that we have down here at Golden Acre Lakers Farm. And here we go, another big hill. Good job. And once we once we get down to the gate, we can actually try to see one of the animals. Let's see if we can find some. All right. So once we are down here, you'll see some of the cattle out down here. And if you be really quiet, you can actually hear some of the goats. Shh, here they come. They think we're gonna feed them, but we're really not gonna feed them. So these cattle are base. They're not. They're not. These these cows are not milking cows. These cows, we're gonna slaughter them about two to three months. Depends on what size they are right now and if any of them have calves, because there's a bull on the other side of the farm. And if they have So we would like to thank you all for joining our hippity hoppity slippity sloppity tour guide around the darkened forest of the world. As always, live life. <laughs>